Hi everyone! Finally, after weeks of waiting, I got my wall charger for my MG4 here, right next to me. And I'm just waiting for the electrician to, to be here and install it. And this is how the box looks like. This is how the box looks like. As you see, that's from MG. Here you got the form, you got the template. I'm planning to install the wall charger right there next to my MBN box. And the, yeah, I got a red color, which will be very good. Well, he got a swap card here because, yeah, so many options. You can swap the car, you can connect to the internet. And over there, there is my electric car. Yeah, ready to be charger, charged. Yeah, from there to there, and bye bye, little granny. <laughs> uh, charger. This is it's very good. That's the one they give it to you. They give it to you with a with a car, but is not the best because it's not very fast. I'm using it is you know like a power board, and uh, yeah, it does the job, but it's just a little bit too slow, and that's why I'm planning to install this wall charger from here. To there and see how we go very soon. I will keep updated. The electrician just left, and as you can see now, it is fixed on the wall and ready to work. Right now, is charging my car, which you can't see because the green light means it's charging. And I'm going to show you the difference between. The MG cable they you know, provide you when you buy the car. This is the box. This is the menu from the wall charger and how fast is. Right now you can tell this is charging from here to there. And the speed is this. How amazing. Can you see? Let me remove the... Yeah, you can see it's a 6.5 kilohertz. It's charging right now and it's it's super super fast now what I'm going to do I'm going to show you from six let me put it okay from 6.5 kilohertz kilo, how is gonna be when I use this I'm gonna plug this charger in the power board regardless if you use the power board or not is the speed is always not that good. So 6.5, remember, I bought the seven kilowatt charger, not the 11 watt, because the 11 watt is a three phase. And uh, to be honest, I don't have a three phase in my place, so it's good as it is. So that's the current one, still, still charging, finishing, blah, 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 70%. I'm gonna plug this in to the car and see how we go. I plug the charger you get when you buy the car which is this one, this is the box comes with. Right now it's charging, you can tell from the lights, power charging, and I'm going to see, that's the cable, it goes there, it's charging again, the lights are green. This is the wall charger, which I'm not using, and I'm going to show you how fast is this, compared to the other one, look at that. 1.5 kilowatt. Imagine, you have to charge your car, from 6.5 to 1.5 is a lot, lot slower. It's like a five times. Basically, when I use my wall charger, this one, one hour with this one, is like five hours with this. That's how fast it is. If you have some money to spend and uh, you wanna charge your EV faster, I recommend you to buy MG wall charger. I bought it for 900 AUD. It's a very good price. Plus, obviously, installation from the electrician. And it's not like a kind of DIY you can do because this is not the kind of wall charger you will plug in the power socket. My electrician went under the roof to bring the cable to do all the installation. It was like a basically three hours job. Obviously, you know, if DIY, no, it's not recommended. This is elect electricity, guys. It's a, it's a, yeah, you need to know what you're doing. So this wall charger is it's very good. There are many other on the market. You can see, you can compare. 
I went with MG because as you see guys I got I can show you my wife got MG car MG3 I got MG4 we are MG family we have a <laughs> We have the MG wall charger. Well, we, we love this brand. What can I do? It's, it's a good brand, reliable. So far, I had this car for six months. No problem at all. My wife had this car for uh, one year. No problem at all. And actually, before the MG4, I got MG XS, SUV, petrol. No problem at all. I went for a road trips. Beautiful. I didn't have any road trip with this yet. I know with electric car, it's more challenging because obviously the range. The range with this one, on 500 kilometers is about sorry in a with full uh, full battery is about 520 kilometers right in the eco mode obviously if you use a sport mode uh, normal mode snow mode it would be lesser if you put the aircon on all this kind of stuff like normal even petrol use the more petrol when you use the aircon so i wanted to show you this charger comes with a swipe card basically if you see here you can see this icon and you can make this charger to only work with a swipe car. I don't really use it. It's a private garage. No one is charging other cars, so it's pretty secure. But if you have the charger outside, you want to make sure you know no one will use it. This is the way. Yeah, you can see charger hub. But yeah, I didn't use it, and I won't probably. I will leave it in the box. <laughs> okay. Hopefully, you like the video. Love, like, and subscribe, and. Uh, See you next. I'm gonna show you this thing has web console where you can log in with your computer and you can configure stuff. I'll show you in, the ne in my next video. Bye.